Hello girls, how you doing? Let's do another pick a card. And today's gonna be how do they see you now? Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's stay cool. Let's not be triggered. Oh my god, all the cards everywhere. Um, yeah, let's just go directly. Okay, so one, two, one, two. Card number one. How do they see you now? Well, three of sword. Okay, I said it. Uh, Wheel of Fortune and the Ten of Wands. Well. Maybe they saw you as a third party at some point, obviously. Or oh, there's been some very harsh words between you uh, two. Now, the thing is, some things have changed because inevitably you got to a point where you said enough is enough. I don't want to carry this on my shoulder anymore. So I'm going to put myself first. So you don't choose me, you choose someone else, blah, blah, blah. Or you talk to me like this. Well, no more because I say I'm done. Yeah, Ten of Wands, it's a little bit like the Ten of Swords, you know, we go through this in order to become an emperor and empress in power. Uh, so the thing is, um, now you're going to go back to the S of Wands after this one. And that's going to be, what about me? What do I want from me? And that's it. So, hmm, no third party anymore. I will let you. Because what we have here is obviously the Wheel of Fortune. And the Wheel of Fortune is good luck, but it's never random. It's preparation, meeting, opportunity. You've been preparing yourself for quite a while because you managed to get to the ten of wands so you had time to think about it. So you went through a process, <laughs> as I always say, to go back to you. Maybe you were giving too much. You were giving too much in that relationship. You're always there, day in, day out. And you realize, no, I want you to go back to me now. Mm -hmm. And as a result, what happened? Well, good stuff started to happen for you. So how does it see you now, like the transformation? You know, after them, you're not uh, uh, next to them. You just moved on or about to move on. Okay. So yeah, you receive the fruit of your labor. Bingo. I love it. Because mm -hmm. a nine of a pentacle, <coughs> excuse me, George is here. Uh, it's someone who's been through everything. I mean, you name it, you went through it. So what you decided to do is to maybe cry the tears. You know, definitely you went through it and now you're back on your feet and you can move to the next level in your life. So you gain a lot of um, power and courage through the experience because you're still standing, you're still very resilient. You surprise them because they didn't think they will recover. <laughs> Hello, who they think they are? Uh, the thing is, at the end of the day, you're not falling for this anymore. Mm -hmm. And now you move to the next level. And they might look at you like, I wish I was more like you. Yeah, it's possible. Because you're going to move on. And also you're much powerful because you choose love. Self-love, the love in general. And self-care, self-respect. So you go back to your feet. And for them, it's like, how dare you moving without me? Well, how dare they to play you and to make you believe you were the only one when you were not? Or to take you for granted with our evil third party. Well, what do they think they are? <laughs> you see what I mean? Come on, right? So how they see you now, they see you as very independent, stronger than ever. And they may be left crying. Well, they are aware of it. I know I was a distraction from your pain. Well, the thing is, they probably hooked you. Um, because they saw you had the low self-esteem or you were searching, you were soul searching and you were easy target. You're easy target. And I think now they realize that you went back on your feet, that you went through the pain. If you don't try to avoid it, you went through it. And now you're still standing even stronger than ever. So they knew somehow who they were choosing. They chose somebody who was maybe a slightly, slightly more open as a love of the heart. Well, it's not that difficult compared to them because there was no opening the heart at all. But, you know, you were searching so, and you were very open, honest, and you were very loving. But now you're loving yourself. Oof. But you had to go through this too as well to, in order to learn your self-respect, self-care, self, you know, whatever. <laughs> you got the memo. <laughs> Yeah, you had to go through this. You don't, you know, you don't become an emperor. An emperor is having a cup of tea and a biscuit, as I like to say. Mm -hmm. Peace, bingo, et voilà. No matter where you are or what you're doing, inner peace is always possible. Mm. All it takes is a subtle shift in awareness. Sink love and peace will follow. Beautiful. That is exactly what I'm talking about with this one. Oh, yeah. 
big time big time maybe financially as well you get better as a result you have a better self-esteem so you make better ch choices you take different decisions you're not at peace but what you do as well and you keep your heart open regardless what you went through with them um you still you of course but you are a better version of you upgraded version like an upgraded phone <laughs> it was funny except <laughs> Moving on, pound number two, what do we do? How do they see you now? Okay, this way. Okay, eight of sword, hmm. three of pentacle and page of wands. Oh, mamma mia. Well, well, well. Mm -hmm. Well, they are frustrated. They are frustrated because, yes, um, that is a frustration big time, uh, because you probably had a limitation uh, of your own mind, but you did that on yourself you uh kind of thought oh no i'm not good enough anyway or oh, i'm sure i can do this and it's the limitation that you may be absorbed from the childhood and the uh, inner child stuff we know but at the end of the day yeah you have a tendency maybe to think uh i'm not enough right so they as a page of ones <laughs> we know what we feel about this one they are kind of using that against you and they're accusing you or blaming you um for being this way or that way and they put their head in the sand they are never the reason of anything or no 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 it's always you you know so they run away from the truth they put their head in the sand they you know i wouldn't trust that person you know what i feel and how i see the pleasure of ones not my cup of tea right so yeah but somehow the way they treated you is maybe going with the way you see yourself too Mm -mm -mm. you're vibrating in a similar way or you were, were vibrating now maybe not anymore because you are very frustrated by that situation and eventually you know what how much more can you squeeze you know and the limitation of your mind enough is enough hmm. so maybe now there's an idea that they were frustrating but you were frustrated too for sure now we have maybe a kind of a transformation here mm, it's quite opposite as you can see they're looking at each other this one wants to say i love you and i'm sorry mm. wow okay bingo because there was an introspection and we have a full moon coming up i don't know when you're seeing this you're watching this video but very soon we have a full moon so what can i say all the kind of hidden truth is coming up it's coming up yeah introspection for sure because all the things they were maybe blaming you for now they realize hey, they have to look within so yeah you obviously had done the same thing introspection you have to look as well within yourself too the hidden part of the iceberg is now visible to you so you can see a lot of things you're revealing yourself to yourself maybe and that's why you cannot uh, entertain this kind of characters mm -hmm. you are far 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 uh, along the way of uh, I'm done and dusted frustrated you think so mm -hmm. yeah because you have now maybe it's your energy you have now that power male female as a man the king of pentacle energy is someone very um, together very grounded I respect people I see people uh, with uh, respect and love and care i don't want to uh, underpay them i don't want to uh, disrespect them in any ways and you can build long term with that person so maybe you decided maybe because they saw you going somewhere else because you had enough and maybe three people in a picture maybe you chose this person instead of them so maybe now they suddenly oh hello oh, i'm sorry i didn't mean it maybe you just went you know arrivederci because you woke up to yourself mm. so now how does they see you and that's probably why they suddenly want to say oh by the way i'm sorry i love you uh mm, too late you know you moved on okay very good good on you good on you because you want to be respected so the way you see yourself and that's why you know that limitation of the mind you cannot have this anymore you cannot entertain this idea any longer mm, 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 mm. no can do this so that's why you you stretching your wings and you're flying away. Bingo. It was beautiful, wasn't it? Okay. We both know I am not the one for you. Well, yeah. Hell yeah. And you realize that, but it took you a while. 
Yeah, because you were hooked on this one. Because this one was reflecting your limitation in the mind, of your mind, that you put yourself on yourself. And then suddenly, bingo. They knew that somehow, you know what, even though I don't like this one much, they do have obviously emotions somehow you know yeah they, they're human they're not <laughs> robots but sometimes yeah they have this and i think with you they had hmm, the knowing the knowing or the knowledge i think it's knowing that you yeah you were something or someone special hmm, i must be a bit difficult then but they chose to you know oh well i had a second of uh, awareness and then no 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 i go back and put my head back in the sand what can I say? Right, okay, so positive outcome, beautiful. The sun is about to burst through the clouds and you will soon see things in a different light. I bet. Something that previously seemed hopeless will soon be filled with nothing but hope. Oof, beautiful. Yeah, you had to go through that, you know, that person <laughs> to realize who you truly are. And that, you know, introspection, revelation, all those things of it, what? Um, you know, allow you to open your eyes on yourself. Beautiful. So positive outcome, of course. And positive outcome to that person as well, somehow. Because thanks to you, because of you, they discover that side of themselves. Mm, revelation here, then. Interesting. On this note, have a beautiful day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah. Ciao.